Hi everybody, it is time for our read aloud and since the, our theme for this week is summer, I got And Then Comes Summer. And the author is Tom Brenner and an author does what for a story? Writes the words and then it's illustrated by Jamie Kim. And what does an illustrator do? The illustrator draws the pictures. So here is the front cover of the book the back cover of the book, and we open up. Is this what Mrs. Sports is looking for? No. Is this what I'm looking for? Yes, I was looking for the title page, and the title of the story is And Then Comes Summer. And I'm gonna open it once. This book is so fancy, it has two title pages, just so you don't forget the story. When the days stretch out like a slow yawn and leave, leaves and grass sparkle with dew and the cheerful faces of Johnny Jump Ups jump up. Johnny Jump Ups are the purple flowers. When bumblebees bumble around in flowers and warbles flit from tree to tree, and the air thrums with the sound of lawn mowers. Then pump up your bike tires, dig out your helmet, and raise your seat. My, how you grow. When the last class project is finished and your cubby is cleaned out of cookie crumbs, and eraser bits and the end of the year hugs have been given. Then swap out backpacks and notebooks for pitchers and cups. They need a lemonade stand. How many friends have made a lemonade stand before? Because I know Mrs. Bortz when she was younger. She had lemonade stands like every day during the summer. When daylight pushes back bedtimes and crickets crick crick in the evening air and bugs as big as thumbs bang against windows, then play hide and seek until darkness wins. When stores on floor, the stars and stripes and flags wave from porches and cars, and the whole town seems wrapped in button. Then dress up your bike and pedal to the parade. When bands march by, left, right, left, right, and all manner of floats float past, and scouts and pioneers toss candy. Then grab your blankets and watch the night explode in colorful sprays. Now what are colorful sprays? What are they talking about? Yes, they're talking about fireworks. When every day is like Saturday and porches and lawns and sidewalks are playgrounds an unfamiliar jingle interrupts the game. Then race to be first in line Almond fudge, please. What's that sound they're listening for? An ice cream truck. I'm not sure I would choose almond fudge. I'd probably go with chocolate. When the dog days of summer roll around and it's so hot you're practically panting and not even the sprinklers provide relief, then it's time to head to the lake. Roll down the window and smell the hot, dry grass. Shout your favorite songs at birds swooping across fields. And for the millionth time, ask, are we there yet? When the familiar sign appears at last and the silver lake winks through the trees 
and old friends run to greet you. Then scramble out of the car, dash down to the beach, and swim till the sun is low and your lips are blue. And when dinner is over and stories have been told and your fingers are sticky with marshmallow and chocolate and the fire burns down to glimmering coals, I'm having s'mores tonight at my brother's house. We're gonna make s'mores over a fire. Then snuggle into your sleeping bags and plan tomorrow's adventure. All right, so I hope you enjoyed. And then came summer, the read aloud. Now what I want you to do is to complete the craft that Miss Lewicki made for you for this summer. All right, so I can't wait to see your crafts and I hope you enjoyed this book. See you soon. Bye.